Hey guys, welcome back to Factoria. This is Eddie Man. Diggy Scenario, episode number two. Today we're going to be looking for water, or quest for water. Um, now, uh, I went ahead and did some off-camera work. Um, we went ahead and got a um, burner miner drill here uh, to burn to mine up some coal and some iron faster. Uh, it looks like the um, that iron patch is done here. Let's just get the remaining coal picked up here. Okay. And then I've just been slowly smelting some iron plates. Um, this looks like a good spot here to put this now. So why not? Let's pick this up. And let's throw some more coal in there and let that have it. All right. Um, so I went ahead and expanded this out with the digging just a little bit. I got this little pocket here. I wanted to see where this little patch ended. Um, and same thing with here. I've been digging down here. Uh, but um, to be able to proceed forward, we actually need power. Um, and the first step for power is finding a body of water. Uh, so we are gonna, I'm gonna dig a little bit on this end here, and see where this gets me. Um, let's just go for it here a little bit. Okay. Get some of this taken care of here, out of the way. What was that? What is that? Is that just a cave-in or? That's weird, but okay. Another thing is, I turned on Are You Afraid of the Dark? Whoa! Look at that! See, that's one of the pockets that I was talking about last in the first episode. Went ahead and just opened up a pocket here. Um, so we're going to have to go ahead and... Oh, that's a cave-in, right? Alright. Um... Can I make any stone walls? I cannot make stone walls yet. Um, bummer. I got this last one here. Let's go ahead then and one, two, three, and then here. Okay. I don't want to mine this right now until I can get some more stone walls put in here. This could be our first like room area-ish area. -ish area. Sounds good to me. Alright, we got some more stone here, some iron ore, some copper ore, and there's some coal there as well. It's only five. Let's just mine that up. Okay. Let's just take a look at what's under here, if I can. this a treasure chest? I think so. <laughs> nice. I got a steel chest. Nice. Okay. That That's going to help. Oh, I got some rails. Okay. Some gears. Alright. Okay. Oh, looks like there is some... Or down here. Let's take a look at what this gets us. So yeah, I, I've turned on Are You Afraid of the Dark. Um, let me know, guys, in the comments what you think. Um, do you think I should use the mod? Um, I went ahead and after I uploaded it to YouTube and released the first episode, I saw that the um, it was kind of dark. 
you know, um, and that kind of sucks with the YouTube compression. Jesus. And I don't have any, I don't have a gun or anything. I don't have anything. Did I make ammo? I made ammo, but I... that stinks, man. I don't have copper. I didn't. I didn't know that you can pick you can pick axe biters. Okay. Um, let's go ahead and get some copper. Wow, I didn't even expect that to happen. That scared me actually. <laughs> uh does the score tell me that? Yes. The score does show it here. You have um, two biters have been liberated. So those are the two biters that I just picked next. Poof. <laughs> that was uh, that was crazy. It was <laughs> all right. Anyway, anyway, let's close that up. Um, this miner is done. It doesn't have any other ores to pick up. And we have plenty of space in there, so we're going to go ahead and just start mining everything up as best as we can here. Okay, and I think I think it's time for me to get another burner miner drill as well here. Let's see if we can make one. I actually got to find more stone to be able to do that. The one piece there. <laughs> and six pieces here. We may as well just pick them up. <laughs> okay. Let's see. All right. Yeah. We can build another mining drill here. All right. And I do have a steel chest. So we'll utilize that. Um, I guess we'll start doing that right here. It's not going to matter, right? Okay. Um, and we don't have any copper yet. So let's go smelt some copper. Shall we? And maybe we'll go ahead and get that gun. That I'm going to need. That's stupid to be down here without a pistol, right? <laughs> just a cave-in and I am stuck again it's a weird glitch there we go So we gotta watch out for those cavens. Now, does it track a caven? No, it does not track a caven anywhere. Oh, cave collapse. Here we go. One. Okay, it does. The score table. Okay. All right. So what we're gonna need to do is, well, we're just gonna have to get power and water. Um, so that is my ultimate goal because I can't do any science research or anything without that fun stuff well we might as well just leave that we know there's nothing underneath there for now 
Okay. And we know there's could be biter potential back here. And I know that there's more ores over here. Oh, there's quite a bit of stone right there. Okay. That's good. Okay. Let's see if we get this big rock here out of the way. Okay. Alright, so that's more ores potential for the base. Uh, let's go over here back to, I guess we'll call this the the start of our base here. It's not real start until we get power though. Um, we're still good with coal, so I don't have to worry about that right now. Let's get a few more of those out of the way here. Let's pick this up. Let's throw these in. Let's see, can we craft a gun now? Yes, we can. Okay, got the gun, and let's make two more magazines. So we have five. Okay. Okay. And we'll just smelt that for now as we go and look for more water. Oh, look for water because we haven't found it yet. I think we should head up a little bit here and see where this takes us. Alright guys, so I uh, did some digging and discovered some biters and I had to kill him. Uh, down here, did the same thing. Found some biters. I uncovered some more of the iron and um, copper and stone little patch here. Uh, but something interesting. A little interesting. No water yet, though. I did uncover another chest here. So we're going to go ahead and dig for that. And I'm going to hit another mi milestone after I kill these biters. Whoo! Still scares me. <laughs> It's still jumping, even though I need to expect it. Uh, that still makes me jump. Alright, I s still can't get to it. Uh, and there's some ore on the ground over here too as well. Oh, come on already. Is that going to open up? Yeah, I'm just about to unlock level 3 here. A couple of these big rocks here will uh, get me that milestone. Let's see. Can we get to it? No, we still can't. There it is. Let's see where we have now. Okay, we got some more stone walls. Wow, we got some productivity modules already. And we got a gun turret. Oh, look at that. Excellent. We have some coins. <laughs> it gave us some express transport belts. That's that's funny. Oh, we have, finally have some lamps as well, too. All right. All right. Let's head back to base. Okay. We got some walls. Oh, we need to fill up some of these, more of these guys here. Let's go ahead and start smelting some more copper all right this one only has four here so let's just mine this okay we can pick that up and then let's do this um you okay you can mine that We're slowly accumulating some base materials here. We still need that water though for power. 
Might as well just mine the rest of this. Okay. <clears throat> it's just, it's kind of nerve wracking. <laughs> to say the least. Okay, so we have some more pillars here. Oh, it's, you know, stone walls uh, that we use as pillars right now. Uh, not enough, not a lot. Just enough to get us to. Um, you know, to prevent cave ins. Like this, uh, I don't. I guess it's a good line to start with. But we need stone. We need to smelt stone for bricks. And we need to start laying the bricks down on the ground. Um, doing so will let us go a distance of four instead of three in between each pillar. All right, but let's go back up here and see if we can unlock that milestone. Just a few more digs. Being very cautious here. I'm gonna unlock any more biters. Oh, so slow. So close though, too. Let's see if this big one will unlock it. There it is. Excellent. So now we can purchase those stone walls. Oh, the what a that's a beautiful thing. That will be a beautiful thing. And we're gonna use that wisely though, of course. <clears throat> and they cost five. We have 537 coins available okay so yeah we're gonna have to use that very wisely um, at least to start off with until we can find a lot more stone ore uh, ever so slowly picking up some more here and there um, I'm not sure if I want to go more east yeah let's go a little bit more here Still trying to find that water. Whew. Well, I just got, uh, I was digging over here, right? And I unlocked like a stone that was here and it opened up this whole area, which was good and everything because of all this iron and mixed some coal and everything. Uh, but about, uh, I would say about 15 biters maybe came out of the pocket and I almost died. <laughs> um, let's make that back to five, the ammo. Um, gonna have to smelt some more iron soon. So let's go ahead and do that. Uh, oops. But um, as you can see, I am running low in coal here. So, um, so yeah, that's uh, is what the next problem is. Oh uh, well, the main problem is no water so far. Um, I should put the miner. I should put a miner down on there. But now we have access to this iron field here. Uh, I'm going to stop iron, mine, mining all this out. Um, I do want to put some pillars down and expand this area out because it looks like there's more coal over here. And that's what we need, right? We need coal. Uh, it's going to be caving. Ooh. I don't want to be stuck with that. <clears throat> okay, so let's go ahead and put one, two, three. Let's put those in there. I know this is quest for <laughs> quest for water, but you know what? Finding all these resources is a plus. <clears throat> Thank you, water save. Finding these resources is definitely good still. Uh, it's just getting more frequently. Whew. 
Okay. <laughs> I'm okay. okay. I promise I am okay. <laughs> oh my goodness. Yeah, the further you get away from the market, the uh, more chance for the biters are going to spawn. Just like that. Uh, and they're getting more aggressive. Whew. Let's make some more of those. When I say those, I meant the uh, magazines. Okay. And we're just gonna go ahead and place those in there and take those out. Obviously, because I'm gonna be smelting. And we should make some another smelter. Why not, right? Well, right now, you can smelt me copper okay while I smelt iron in the other one what I should do is place down this turret right since I'm getting so many biters coming from over here um do I want to do that yeah you know what let's go ahead and do that Okay, and I'll make just a few more magazines just for myself here. Because that's like the third time in this little cluster here that biters will come out of the stone like that. Whew. Looks like I'm going to have to buy some more stone pillars, so let me go ahead and do that. Okay, so... Let's buy five for now. Okay. Put it there. We might as well just uncover this whole patch, right? See how far this patch goes. So I went ahead and I dug a little farther and I followed the path of the iron. Remember we unlocked this whole area here with the iron uh, vein. I'm, I'm calling it because it looks like it keeps going down here towards the south but if you look yeah I went, went a little crazy with the pillars and started putting support pillars up um, it come up here and look we found our source first source of water here I actually like how green and mucky it looks in the cave here it looks pretty awesome but yeah we actually have a section here that we can place a pump finally yep perfect it's small but it'll, it'll do so I think I'm gonna mine out this little section here and we'll put our power there let's get that out of my hand over here and we'll put the power source here and then we'll go from we'll go from there actually um, I'm going to line up these support beams or poles or walls, whatever you guys want to call it. And as you can see here, I have a lot of carnage on the ground. <laughs> the get biters kept coming out. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much going to, I think, wrap up for this episode. I know it's tedious with this digging and getting our resources and everything as you can see here I'm starting to mine and I got a ton of ore so ready to go uh, now I just gotta get basic power up and running uh, get some power to smelting get power to mining uh, so we can stop using the coal that much for you know manually feeding and we can bring the coal up to power and 
feed power. I think that's going to work best for us for this series. But I'm going to go ahead and wrap up this one here um, with the couple takes I did and slimming the videos down. Should have a pretty decent episode length here. As you guys can notice, I did go ahead and change my character to black. <laughs> Keep that theme of the black, right? Um, and that's pretty much it. Um, I did buy a bunch of the pillars from the market. And I am on level 4 now. So we could buy a pistol and we could buy firearm magazines. But I made my pistol. Why would I waste... As long as I don't die, which I don't plan on dying. It did come close a little bit. But each magazine is 5 coins. Now I'd rather buy a stone wall than I would a magazine, right? I have all this iron, I can just craft my own magazines. So, uh, eventually I'll be able to buy a f raw fish uh, if I need that in close fight with the biters. Um, I have to make sure I don't die. I don't have access to lights yet, but with the um, Are You Afraid of the Dark mod, I think I, I think that covers the darkness. I, I know that's uh, time of recording. The f only the, well, obviously only the first episode is out, uh, so and I haven't had any feedback from you guys yet. What you guys think? Because honestly, I haven't told you guys yet. <laughs> Um, but that's it. I, I'm pretty much done rambling for this episode. Again, thank you guys so much for joining me in this episode of Factorio. If you haven't yet, please go ahead and consider throwing me a like on this video. It greatly helps me and the channel out. And if you want to, if you're excited about this series as much as I am and you want to stay up with everything, Eddie Man, please go ahead and subscribe to the channel as well. Right now, thank you so much again for joining me in this episode of Factorio diggy scenario um and like always i'll see you guys next time bye bye